Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So excuse the audio today, you're just relying on the camera inbuilt microphone. But I wanted to bring you a video where I am exploring what has been great purchases that have helped make this rental home a home for me and my partner. And we are in a bedroom again and it is very nice actually because there's this gigantic window where the sunlight is coming streaming in and it makes for good lighting so I'm very happy with that. In this room, the first thing that I purchased was actually a Joey mattress. It's not a necessity because when you rent and when you rent fully furnished, they actually have the bed frame and the mattress ready for you to use but I wanted to use my own mattress because I really care about my body and getting good rest so that's why I replaced the mattress with a Joey and the next thing that I bought was bed sheets I think you can buy any bed sheet you know it's really up to you but my friend recommended Arism by Uniqlo so I wanted to try it out and I will put the price that it cost me right here and I didn't buy that many because I already have some queen size bed sheets from back home so I brought most of them and I changed my bed sheets very often so that is very useful and it's not a necessity still but it really helped to make this home feel nicer because you are treating your body to some good rest but let me show you the things that are actually a necessity to me let's go okay so we are in the room in which I film, this is another bedroom. We requested that they remove the bed frame and mattress so that we could have a space where we could do work and study. So this I guess is called the study. And this is my friend. This is my best friend right here. This guy was I guess the best purchase that I made for this household because I definitely don't want to do housework all the time so I like to delegate it out to something else and this guy is a Xiaomi robot he's super useful what it's doing right now it's in its charging dock and it's charging and if you lift the lid this is where the the dust bunnies congregate and you can actually take this out and you can give it a good clean so this is the filter and you can wash that out um, and let it dry then you put it back in and it actually runs on Wi-Fi if you want you can actually track its progress around the home but I don't really do that I just like to watch it as it goes about its business but my favorite part is actually that it is a mop as well so this mopping pad I took it out before because I clean it and you can wash it scrub it clean and you can put like water and a little bit of detergent in here if you really want so that when when it mops it is really cleaning the floor and they have like this this part that is like I guess the the broom feature where it's sweeping and it sometimes collects hair here that you can clean out as well this purchase I definitely made straight away because in my family home my mom uses this when we are not physically cleaning the floors ourselves we have this guy to thank and that actually cuts down the household chores amount of hours it takes to to clean up and things like that so in this room we have like these like filming stuff so these aren't mine these are my partners that i borrow so if you want to see a behind the scenes i'll show you right now for filming this is the backdrop to where I am sitting. It is quite plain, there's nothing much going on here. And uh, we received a carpet from my partner's parents that they are not using. So this helps absorb a bit of the sound. To give you an idea of what we did, I purchased this island set and it came with these four, four bar stools. And I spent 880, I mean it's not a necessity again, but it's something that I really wanted to have in this room because we work a lot and if we are working from home, this is something that is going to be fully utilized and for sure, uh, you've seen this before, my, 
microphone that I'm not using right now and you know I sit here I film my videos I edit them I work here and that is <laughs> the view that I get in place of you all when I am filming that is that's what it looks like and if you're wondering what these are these are the cushions to the couch that's outside I put them here to absorb a little bit more of the sound if that helps but yes the star of the show is really this guy right here in the corner best best purchase <laughs> that we've made for this house so it's a bit dark but we are here in the kitchen they don't really have um great lighting when it comes to the kitchen everything's like just warm warm light as you can see from above i didn't buy it i got it from my mom she was so kind enough to give me this and it's right here in this corner it is this water filter this actually really helps make a home a home and it's connected directly to the sink you just push that and it will dispense water and this is super necessary when you move into a home because you want clean drinking water and we opted for this because it was the cheaper alternative in place of getting a water dispenser so instead of that what we did was actually buy a kettle and this boils water like just any other kettle this is a Xiaomi smart kettle but it's not the pro version the pro version would show you the water temperature and it has like more keep warm features but I thought this was sufficient enough I will link it down below if you are interested they have very nice um, sleep design and it's useful I drink lots of water every day and I really like this glass this one we bought on sale from the Robinsons move out sale and I use this the most but we have a whole bunch of different cups and glasses so these ones are ones that I got from Shopee they are quite similar I guess in functionality where there are these like insulated glass glass type or actually is it glass I guess like it's a blend of glass this one feels more like glass but this one's way cheaper I actually put my breakfast in these like you can have cereal and yogurt in them and they look very very pretty I will link it down below for you because I got them off Shopee and speaking of Shopee or Lazada I think this was purchased on Shopee it is so useful it is this drying rack in the previous video you have seen it hadn't arrived yet but it has like place to dry your cutlery place to dry your knives and also your giant ass chopping board and these are some things that have been very useful for the house I think this cost us 70 ringgit which was pretty decent for its size and its functionality um, something that we want to bring you to see here is this pot you, you're gonna need some crockery for cooking especially when you move out you want to cook home as much as you can to save more money and also like it's delicious right to like eat home cooked meals I always prefer that over eating out this past Friday we cooked spaghetti and this was a really good size so this one we got from his parents but this one we purchased so this frying pan we did get online and it comes with this um, handy cover so you can cover your food um, while cooking or after and it's really really useful I will link it down below and this one I guess everyone's seen is from IKEA and this useful things that we have for cooking I got from my mom thanks mom for the uh, cooking utensils and also what you're gonna need every house should have some bowls some plates this ones we got from my partner's parents again these ones we purchased from ikea i think we have a couple more maybe like four more coming in the mail and so you're gonna need some cutlery in your life you just open that and we got a set of six from ikea you can choose from many different styles i really like this particular style if i can remember what we bought i will link it down below i think we spent 170 ringgit for a set of 
six fork spoon knives and also it came with some small spoons, teaspoons. So that's very useful. Hmm. Other than that, I guess like this is not a necessity but we bought a small oven toaster. I mean, I use it to toast bread and like to reheat up food but we do have the oven that has come with this place in terms of rent. I, I don't know, maybe if we bake we will use this but if not, let's conserve a bit more energy and use the tiny one. There is a microwave that came with the place and I haven't used this one yet. This is a air fryer. It's a particularly small air fryer and I'll let you know when I use it but at the moment it's not one of the necessities that I would say I highly recommend yet. Yeah so I guess like that's it for what I would recommend in terms of what I've purchased for this kitchen. Other than that you know like just regular things like cloths. Mm. I got a bunch of cloths from Ikea. You know whatever fits your preferences. I guess like every house needs knives and you would have seen the set of knives that my partner purchased. They were like really expensive knives and you know I was happy just using the knives that my mom gave me. She gave me two knives but you know some people like a flare of things and some people just like baseline and you know like you go in between for when you are living with people um, and it's all about compromise. I'm sure there are a lot of things that I missed out you know like the necessities like toilet brushes and all of that but I'm not gonna show you my toilet brushes because that's really not cool but I will link it down below if you're interested. They were this like silicone type that I wanted to try out because I always had the normal round one with the bristles and just some just want to try out something different. I I guess that's it for this video on the things that I purchased to make this home a home. Uh, we don't have an ironing board but what we do have this Tefal steamer. This one we also got from my partner's parents because they weren't using the steamer and I thought that was going to be very convenient for us and they were very kind to give it to us. So hmm, I actually really like filming in this room because it's so bright but it, a lot of you don't like the look of filming in your bedroom so let's stick to the study room. Anyway, I hope you're having a great week so far. I will probably do a video at some point in time looking at how my finances have changed or like managing finances with your partner together. Maybe when we have actually figured it out, I will get to that. But in the meantime, take good care and have a great day. Bye!